your first experience of Wembley. How good does that feel? How does that compare to the NRL Grand Final for South Sydney in 2004? Unbelievable, Wagger. It's um. Now, I've actually been dying to be interviewed by him. It's taken all this time. <laughs> it's taken a while. Mate, I've, seen you, I've seen you for so many games, and I'm like, yeah, he might come and get me this time. But finally, Matt, sorry, Matt. Took, took us to win sorry, you're cup, straight in. You're straight in. Mate, it, was a, uh, it was unbelievable. Um, a big effort from, from all the boys. Yeah. Um, you know, it, it's just, it still hasn't fully sunk in yet, I don't think. Yeah. And I don't know when because it will, but it's Going into this game, you're underdogs. They've been yeah. three times this year in the league. Yep. Uh, they're playing well, the league leaders. Going into this game, but filming that start, how intense yeah. will that game compare? to games you played in Australia? Mate, it was it was up there. Um, you know, the heat comes into it as well. Yeah. You know, starting the game as well, it's probably a bit of a, a new concept for me. I've, a lot of my career, I've come off the bench and yeah. um, Price has had me starting a few games. So it's something new for that? me. Yeah, it's different. Yeah. And I've been enjoying it. Um, but, mate, today was unbelievable. And it's uh, something I'll never forget, definitely. It's Callum Hart. How disappointed with that? Yeah, yeah, huge. Yeah, um, yeah tough one to take, really. Um, you know, we've, we've been... A lot of us have never, never been to this game before, and it's a, it was a piece of the puzzle for quite a few of us. And uh, you know, credit Warrington today, we fell short, and, and um, they took the chances. The tackle of the game's got to be about you on Tommy Makinson. Uh, all day long he scores them, but not today. I'll tell you, um, during the week we sort of had, I had a chat with some of the boys saying, because you know, he, you know, he dives like you can't push him out because he yeah. dives in the air. He's so good at it, you know. So. <laughs> You can only put the ball sort of on one patch of grass, can't yeah. he? So I said during the week, and funny enough, it came off. I said, if he dive, does that, I'm just going to dive for that corner of grass, you know, where he yeah. puts it down. And then, so today it, it came off. I was just like, I'll try it because I can't push him out of it. I did it the other week and scored. So made it come off, and some of the boys are laughing about it now. But how does that compare? You've played in some big games. How does that compare? Challenge, Challenge Cup again. To win it yeah. um, against St. Helens, underdogs, to beat three times in the league. Um, yeah. Unbelievable effort. Well, um, mate, I think everybody didn't really give us a chance, did they? So we knew uh, by f within ourselves that yeah. we were the only ones that thought we could yeah. win. And we turned up and put in a great display and we won. Won it and played really well, to be fair. I thought when you scored in the second half, you were back in it. Yeah, you know, it was a difficult game. Uh, didn't go our way, but, you know, Challenge Cup final, you got a winner and the loser. So, you know, it's a disappointed, but... We all for you know if we keep playing yeah. as good as, as we can be, then uh, you know that second half could, could change the game, and you know I thought maybe uh, my try could uh, could change the game, and you know come back. We had a few opportunities, but you know it just didn't go our way. And uh, fair play to Warrington, uh, they were better. Would you say that's the quickest, most intense game you've played in your career up to date? Yeah, it was a tough game, very tough game. You know, I think both teams completed high and. Yeah. Uh, you know, I think it was a good game to watch for the yeah. for the supporters and uh, you know, Challenge Cup final. You, yeah. you know, it doesn't come every every year, and uh, you know, both teams went for it, and uh, yeah. you know, yeah, disappointed today. How good were your defence? Not just your attack, you were <coughs> clinical, like stopping Tommy Makers in the corner, yeah. nice and good win. What, what unbelievable! It's just, hey, hey it's just, it comes down to a game plan, doesn't it, Ragged? Yeah. And you know, if you, no matter what the game plan is, yeah. if one to seventeen believe in that game plan, and whether it's right or wrong. It generally works and it will work. And today we had we had one to seventeen. Yeah. Believed in what we were going to do. You know, we were playing with one half back, and <clears throat> I know and Jack put birds over. And, you know, <laughs> yeah, straight yeah, in. Yeah. Straight. But uh, you know, we stuck to a, we needed a plan and we stuck to it, and that's what we did today. And and Joe, and the, you see the results. Uh, the result went our way. I'm so proud of of that team because what they've done is they've become you know they've become legends of this yeah, club now. They, they've they've they'll be remembered yeah. um, which is which is fascinating um, but also for the fans and also the owners yeah. and the board of directors that have continued to support this team and this club with the finance and the resource and the backing the fans that continue to support this club we've got a fantastic fan base I'm more made up for those guys as well yeah. as, as much as I am with the players because you know like I said it's been a fantastic day um, for this club and, yeah. and, and thoroughly deserved as well you must be proud as punch we are men today oh unbelievable I thought 1-17 to the way we did it, the game plan, and we'd set out all week. A lot of people had written us off as a yep. one-horse race, yep. um, but we had the belief within us uh, that we could do it, and like I say, emotion ran high at the end. For me, what about the defence? Defence impressed me more than anything, because at times, at patches, you look down and out, you're just covering each other's yeah. back. Bryson Goodwin in the corner when Daz Clark, Clark chased back with two minutes left of the game. We know, we know what wins finals and defence yep. wins finals. We know we only had to score a couple, but if our defence was on, 
yeah. we'd win. Um, and it, like I said, the scramble and the effort and the energy we had was, was unbelievable. Look at this, he's, he's having a beer. Hey, Look at that. When, when will yeah. this stop, though? You've got a game, you've got to back up, you've got to yeah, straight well, back to the league. Uh, I'm sure, well, can we move that Thursday, Thursday game to Sunday, please? How the hell we want to move it? How can you celebrate a win? Yo, the, you need a week. Hey, we, I'll, know. Hey, we know, we know. We're drinkers, well, we I'm, need a I'm week. I'm 38 years old, <laughs> right? I will never ever experience this again. Nah, you know, you've got to go. So, and I'm going to play on Enjoy Thursday. It. Oh, well, somebody's going. To, I might have to play on Thursday. <laughs> you might but I'm going to be prepared on for, for Thursday. Change the game, guys. Change the game. Change the game. This is for West. Change the game. <laughs> <laughs>